Hey guys, this is Rob and um, after uh, posting the teaser of my uh, dengue video, somebody asked me on Facebook story to uh, talk about something that is uh, also very important for many people. Although hindi ito life and death, ano? but it causes a lot of social um, isolation to, to, to some people because of the effects of loss of uh, confidence. Uh, the topic is about acne. Alright, acne. Tigyawan. Yan. There are several um, um, levels of acne. Alright, so but let's not be too uh, scientific about uh, this. But let's just go on to the basics. Okay. Ang ating uh, skin, okay, may tinatawag na sebaceous gland. Nag-secret yan ng oily substance. Alright? So, dapat yung oily substance na yan, ilalabas lang sa skin. Okay? Natural kasi sa skin natin na mayroong oiliness. Alright? Now, kapag itong mga uh, uh, oil na ito ay hindi nakakalabas sa ating skin, namumuo siya, nakakaroon ng infection sa loob. Tinatahanan siya ng mga bacteria. Alright? So, it's like this. This is the skin and this is the sebaceous gland. Nagsisigret siya ng oil. Dapat lalabas siya yung oil. Alright? Yan. Lalabas sa skin. Okay? Ang problema, kapag ka hindi yan lumalabas, of course, syempre nagkakaroon yan ng accumulation sa loob and then magkakaroon ng um, uh, bacterial uh, infection. Kaya, yun siya nakikita mong namumula na mamagka, nagkakaroon ng infection yung nana. Ngayon ay tinatawag nating tigyawat. Alright? So, now, ano ba yung mga causes niyan? Siyempre, especially kapag ka, um, uh, yung mga nagbibinata or nagdadalaga, eh parang naka, um, what do you call this? Naka-hyper uh, active yung tinatawag na uh, production of uh, hormones. Alright? Kasi from a body of a child, alright? nagigigin na siyang adult. Ito adolescent. Ayun. All right. So, ang nagiging effect niyan, all right, yung mga paglabas ng mga hormones na ito eh nagkakaroon ng over secretion ng oil. Ayun. Ngayon, syempre kapag may over secretion ng oil, alam na natin na pagka hindi 'yun lumabas, okay? sa skin, okay, ay nagkakaroon siya ng infection. At yun na nga yung tinatawag nating tigyawat. So, paano natin yan treat, Okay, so okay ha. Tandaan natin, hindi po yan, uh, what do you call this, hindi dapat maging source iyan ng iyong pagkawala ng confidence or self-confidence. Alright? Um, halos lahat naman ng tao eh dumadaan dyan, no? Um, especially mga teens na nanonood. Okay, ako rin noon, napakarami kong mga tigyawat uh, nung ako ay high school. Alright, at salamat na lang at na-discover natin yung mga tamang mga kagamutan para mabawasan kung hindi man mawawala yung uh, tigyawat. Alright, so now... Okay, so let's start first with uh, lifestyle modification. That's very important, no? Iwasan ng oily food. Iwasan ng oily food, iwasan ng sobrang pagpupuyat para hindi na di-disturb yung, uh, yung uh, body clock. Para disturb kasi yung body clock mo, pati production ng hormones mo, eh parang nalilito na rin. Okay, so yun yung effect kung bakit parang pagka nagpuyat ka, eh but kinabukasan, eh meron ka panibagong tigyawat, ganyan. Okay, so dapat meron ka regular sleep. Okay? So sa bed mo kailangan malinis yung iyong mm, pillow cases. Dapat regularly napapalitan 'yan. Even your uh, bed sheets, okay? So kailangan very clean. Also, don't touch your um, uh, face with your uh, bare hands especially during the day. Ah, uh, kasi madumi 'yan. Hawak lang tayo ng doorknob. Merong presence ng dif different ah uh, bacteria especially ang most uh, common bacteria na present sa ating tigyawat ng staphylococcus okay so staph 
normally normally present yan sa mga doorknob, sa mga table, sa mga yeah. So it's a very common bacteria. So ang skin mo pag nahawakan mo yan and then may opening, pwede rin siyang mag-stimulate ng pagkakaroon ng uh, uh, acne or pimples. And also, dapat iwasan na nagkakaroon ng unnecessary pressure sa iyong skin. So, pag natutulog ka, mas magandang um, nakaharap na ganun so that there's no unnecessary pressure sa iyong face. Alright? So, para hindi na didisturb yung, yung uh, uh, skin. Okay. Now, ano ba yung dapat gawin? Okay, if you are very oily, there are many ways which you can uh, treat your uh, pimples. Siyempre, pag malalaya, punta tayo ng dermatologist. Pero kung medyo, ano lang, eh, mm, pwede naman yung home treatment. Okay, so, ang mga marirecommend ko na, in my experience, very effective is, if too much ang oil lang face mo, maganda yung sulfur soap. So, may Dr. Wong's, may ano pa bang mga sulfur soap yan, ayan. So, what I do, pag meron akong pimple, alright, uh, I get a, like a little part of that sulfur soap and just uh, massage it like that and then wash it away. So, yung sulfur kasi is a uh, somehow uh, harsh to the um, bacteria inside the uh, pimples. No? So, uh, namamatay yung bacteria in the presence of sulfur. So, yun yung ano niya, yun yung effect niya. Okay, ano pa ang maganda? Yung orange soap, yung kojic soap, what, what kojic soap does is, um, when you use it, alright, so you use it like mga 20 seconds, right? And then, ang gagawin niyan is keratolytic, alright, keratolytic or keratolytic. Magagi, magiging um, flaky yung skin mo on the outside, alright? Na-exfoliate niya yung outer layer of the skin, keratolytic. So, titigas yan and then titigas yung very, very fine layer of outer layer of the skin. Alright? Parang na-exfoliate niya yan. And then, nagre-renew yung skin. So, nakuha niya kanina, di ba? May pressure. Pagka na linis mo yan, tapos nag nilagay mo ng keratolytic. Okay? Alright. So, malalabas yung, yung outer layer. O, di syempre, yung pressure or yung the... What blocks, alright, the release of the sebaceous secretions will no longer be there. So, di ba? So, parang parang binigyan mo siya ng very, very fine space where the oil can go out. So, that's very good. So, keratolytic soap, alright? Now, if your skin is very sensitive, hindi pwede yun, okay? Gamit tayo ng mga neutral lang na soap. Yung Neutrogena, ano pa ba? Basta soap na oil atom. Oil atom is good. Okay? Pagka ang skin mo is very sensitive. Okay? Parang hapding-hapdi ka kapag gumagamit ka ng sulfur soap or yung kojic soap. Alright. Ano pa ba yung mga ginagamit dyan? Yung iba gumagamit ng tretinoin. Tretinoin is the same effect, no? Nag, uh, 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 pinatanggal niya yung outer, the outermost fine layer of the skin. Hindi yung skin, ha? Alright? So, just outermost. Now, don't overuse this. Because if your skin is exfoliated and um, exposed to sunlight or UV rays, baka sunburn yan. Baka naman masira ang yung skin. Magkakaroon ng overproduction of melanin. Ito yung nakikita ng yung melanoma, yung parang nangingitim na hindi natatanggal. So, we, we be very careful. So, you use sunblock during the day. Okay. Ito yung magic solution ko. <laughs> oh, ready na ba kayo? Uh, aside from the soaps and all na ginagamit para sa um, uh, pimples, kapag tinubuan ka ng pimple, ito ang gagamitin. Tada! Adapalin. Can you see it? Alright. Adapalin. Benzoyl peroxide. Ayan. Uh, benzoyl peroxide, okay, it is said that, um, Okay, may oxygen kasi itong benzoyl peroxide, right? Okay, may, may oxygen ito. So, imagine, the bacteria living inside your, your pimple, alright, is afraid of oxygen. It's anaerobic, okay? So, once you supply oxygen, namamatay yung bacteria. So, what you do is just get a little, um, uh, at the pee, 
P is even smaller than that size, B size. And then, alright, we put it there. And then, you put, wala akong pimple ngayon kahit isa, but so, you choose one part where there is a pimple, say like that. And then, you just massage it circular on a circular motion. And again, like that. Alright. And that's enough. That's it. Usually, kapag yung pimple mo, hindi masyadong malaban, timbatigas ang ulo, the following day, medyo aatras na yan. And then, lagay na naman, on the second day, ah, tuyo-tuyo na siya. This is very, very effective. Adapalin. Meron ding version nito yung, ano ba bang iba nito? Basta may benzoyl peroxide. Benzac AC is good. So, merong 5% yan, may 2.5, tapos may 10%. Okay? So, mm, since hindi naman mal, um, like malala, so, mm, I recommend yung gitna. 5%, ganyan. Or 2.5%. Kasi, kapag ginamit nyo yung 10%, I think that is too strong. Sobra namang nagda-dry yung skin. And, parang minsan nasusugat naman. Alright, so... <laughs> 11 minutes na, ang bilis. Okay, so, I hope that video, uh, this video helped. And if it helped you, and you try these recommendations, of course, um, this is a broad topic, so this may not be the last video about uh, acne. Alright, so, uh, that's it for now. So, please hit the uh, subscribe button, either here or here. And then hit like, and then share the video. If you think that uh, it is useful. And thank you. Bye-bye.